In autumn 2012, two adventurers, Andrew and Dave, travelled from Brisbane to O'Allen Ford near Neriga to paddle the Shoalhaven River from O'Allen Ford to Tallowa Dam. A five-day exploratory trip was planned, so preparation for a seven-day journey was necessary. This meant camping equipment, food and safety equipment were needed. One tent and dehydrated food were shared, an EPIR was carried in one kayak and a satellite phone in the other. First aid kits were carried in both vessels. The journey started on a day that could not be bettered. Beautifully sunny and calm with a favourable weather forecast. The river height was ideal too. Too low would mean more portaging past difficult sections resulting in a very slow journey and too high would make the river too dangerous and the expedition called off. Andrew in the green and Dave in the blue kayak set off after lunch for their first campsite at Peggy's Reach. Dave's car was driven to Wollongong to await a phone call for the anticipated pickup from Tallowa Dam. Both paddlers carried waterproof pocket cameras to capture each other shooting some of the rapids. On day two, this rapid was photographed by Dave after Andrew had shot it. In this rapid, Andrew's right arm was hyperextended and his shoulder dislocated when his paddle caught the water. After many attempts to contact the ambulance service, a rescue helicopter with paramedics and doctors was dispatched to deal with the injury. All attempts to relocate the shoulder in the field failed and a flight to Canberra Hospital was necessary. Dave was left to deal with the retrieval of both kayaks and equipment the following day. Andrew spent an uncomfortable night of relative luxury in Canberra. Phone calls by Dave resulted in his car being returned to Neriga and preparing the retrieval commenced. Andrew and partner arrived from Canberra by hire car and helped with the recovery. This was involved to begin with but once underway it was straightforward, although very physical. Mm -hmm. 